Just one night after Halloween, the Oregon Ducks hosted the Stanford Cardinal, a team that boasts one of the scariest defenses in the nation. And Oregon countered back with some strong defense of their own and pulled it out 45 to 16 in a very convincing win here at Autzen. The strong defensive showing received plenty of help from Eric Dargan, who caught his 11th career interception and was also credited with a forced fumble. Another important piece of Oregon's defensive game came from back Ifo Akpre Olamu, who said limiting Stanford's big plays was key to their success. And we're trying to win the game on defense and try to limit them and make them earn every single point that they get rather than giving up big plays or giving blowing assignments. We wanted to force them to drive downfield. And I mean, they, they did an okay job, but at the same time, they weren't able to get all the way into the end zone. That's a good job by the defense. With Stanford's offense silent, Oregon's offense went to work, putting up 46 points over a Cardinal team that hasn't given up more than 30 points to a team this year. Quarterback Marcus Mariota pushed for big numbers, throwing for two touchdowns and running for two more. He credited Oregon's blocking as an important part of the Knights' offensive strength. You know, they gave me a lot of opportunities to, to pull on some zone reads, and, and um, you know, the guys outside did a good job blocking. Um, you know, overall, I, I mean, you know, the guys up front and those guys outside did an awesome job blocking for our run game, and, you know, that's what really kind of... Uh, triggered a lot of a lot of yards and, and a lot of first downs. A lot of those yards and first downs were from Oregon running backs Royce Freeman and Thomas Tyner. Freeman rushed for a team high 101 yards, while Tyner carried in two touchdowns to help the team secure their win. The victory was Oregon's first over the Cardinal in two years, allowing the team to finally bury the hatchet. The Ducks are already moving on from this Stanford victory. They're looking forward to their game against Utah next weekend on the road. The Ducks are now 8-1 on the season, 5-1 in conference play. In the meantime, this loss puts Stanford at four total losses on the season. Reporting from Autzen Stadium, I'm Samantha Saldivar for Duck TV Sports.